Now, everybody loves a good reboot, and sometimes the original should be left alone. Now, I don't know if y'all remember, but about, I don't know, about a year some change ago, there was a trailer for a darker spin of the Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. The only reason why you're not in jail is because Uncle Phil called in a favor. You are carrying a gun on the streets to protect yourself? I've done my best, Will. But it's time for a change. You're going to Bel Air to live with your uncle and your auntie. In this house, I'm not Uncle Phil. I'm the law. Have I made myself absolutely clear? Yeah. Yeah. Pretty aggressive, but very much like in that true Philly spirit. I wasn't mad at it. So, word on the street is Will Smith's Overbrook Company is, is actually shopping at Bel Air Reboot to multiple networks, including Netflix, HBO Max, and more. They even got some of the original Fresh Prince of Bel Air producers involved to help pitch it. I think it's kind of dope, and I think it might be a to go. If you haven't seen the fan made trailer for the original Bel Air joint, you can check it out on YouTube. It's actually pretty solid. You'll be impressed. Moving on to another hip hop news, let's talk about the game. All right, now. Now, some people talk about, hey, if you could trade somebody from this race to another race, who would you pick? Later for that, the game actually wants to trade souls. He uh, took to social media yesterday with this statement, and I quote, Pop Smoke dead but 69 alive. Hashtag. Guess rats outliving humans now. And, you know, when you look at it in the larger scope of things, Takashi 6 9 went out there and did all the things that no one ever thought he was going to be able to pull off. Told on everybody in his gang, got out, he's shooting music videos, he's moving around the city, he's security up, and he's getting crazy money. And people can't wait to do songs with him. Shoot, Akon even gave him his locked up song to redo. And come to find out that's going to be on Akon's next album. Crazy. On the flip side of things, Takashi 6 9 actually showed love to Pop Smoke and uh, did a post on his IG stories that says, I wish you were still here. Long live Pop Smoke. Rest up. I think sometimes it's all fun and games in these streets that somebody actually dies. Then all of a sudden, everybody misses that person. It's moving on. Now, let's talk about Kanye West. He is still talking this running for president stuff, and he actually put out a 10-point plan for his political platform. Uh, some of those things include restore faith and revive our constitutional commitment to freedom of religion and the free exercise of one's faith, demonstrated by restoring prayer in the classroom, including spiritual foundations. Another one is to restore the sound national economy, reduce household debt and student loan debt. I mean, he actually has some really valid points here. The problem is, once again, you're not going to be on every ballot. You're going to distract people from voting for the lesser of the two evils that we'll have to vote for. And we'll go into that later on this morning, but it's just like, come on, man, there's enough confusion in the world. We don't need anybody else muddying the carpet. It's already ugly out there, but... I digress. For this and other stories I'm following, Twitter, Instagram, and SoundCloud, H-E-A-D-K-R-A-C-K. We are the morning hustle.